Do you know how to integrate this? By partial fractions? Yes, you can do that. But it is time consuming. Here, I show you a much simpler solution. Let's look at the derivative of the bottom part. x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7. We know the derivative of this one equals 4 times x cubed minus 4 times 3, 12 x squared plus 2 times 2, 4 x minus 4. We take the common factor 4 out, so 4 times x cubed minus 3 x squared plus x minus 1, which is exactly the numerator. That means the numerator equals a quarter of the derivative of the bottom part. So we can write a given one as a quarter of the derivative x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7 prime dx over the bottom x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7. We can take the factor a quarter out, so 1 over 4. And this part actually is the differential of the denominator. So we can write as e x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7 over the same function. So x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7. We know the antiderivative is the ln function. So we get a quarter ln absolute value x to the power 4 minus 4x cubed plus 2x squared minus 4x plus 7. And because it is indefinite integral, so we need to plus 6. That's all.